finding Gunnallon very nice. It's not as good as the Little Bay, but it's, uh, it's decent. So far I've ridden the three big coasters. I've ridden the broomstick. than the jet line. the wild man. First time on a wild man, I think. I might have gone before, I don't remember. But damn! Those lateral G's on the unbanked turns. They're horrible. Jet line, I must warn you all, worse than Lisa Bay's bone on. Very sharp turns, and the mid brakes had very sharp stops. The broomstick was nice, calm, I could almost sleep on it. Jet line had very many sharp turns. It almost felt like what one sees in some roller coaster tycoon 3 rides. And those fixed pieces where, um, say, you want to bank just a little bit, one car length, and it just banks. But hasn't stopped me from going on it. You just need to take breaks in between. Same thing with the wild mouse. Another thing, they seem to be more strict about them. Um, filling the cars in the roller coaster. When there was only one space left, uh, they uh, directed just me, but only me, towards that empty space. So I had to sit with a complete stranger. So when coming to Grand Alun, if you are an uneven number, then, uh, uh, then someone gets cut me. Almost like booking a table. Yes, hi, I'd like to coach the car for one thing. How many are riding? I will be three, please. Plenty of seagulls, but no donkey. and I got myself some souvenirs. <laughs> the first thing I wrote on was the, and I got myself a photo of myself here. Then I decided to um, try out the wild mouse. My first wild mouse, I think. I think it's the first. 
Was there a wild mouse at the uh, Tivoli Gardens at uh, Copenhagen? Anyway, here's a picture. Yep, typically wild mouse. Not too typically. It did have uh, banks in its turns. Almost felt like the thing was going to fall off the tracks. That was very nice. And then, after a while, I decided to stand in the long line to the uh, broomstick. Surprisingly smooth. I could practically sleep on it. And uh, by the looks of things, um, when I looked at the cues to these three roller coasters, it seemed like uh, Jetline was the least uh, popular one. Second was the Wild Mouse, and first in line was uh, the Broomstick. And as I can see here, the Broomstick is new for this year. There were only two other um, rides that I um, went on. Um, well, one was uh, the Viking ship. Never managed to get a seat at the very end. I understand that those are the most popular seats. And I went into the uh, fun house. And I'll see if I can get a part of that. I'm afraid I am... Um, I don't think I'll dare to take a part out of the roller coasters. Maybe the later work. I'll uh, see what other pictures and films I'll be doing tomorrow. I might do the fun house if I get permission. I won't do the roller coasters. That's where theme park review comes in. Or coaster force. Well, that's all I'm gonna say to the, tonight. Got to stay on film here. Night. get any more pictures of Greenland or film. All oh, because it rained. And I didn't get time to take any pictures of anything else. I was afraid the camera would get wet. But we did go out. We did go out in the rain either way because the hotel didn't uh, serve lunch or dinner so we went out into town walked around a little got hungry decided to stop by Burger King and uh, then continued on looked at the shops and noticed a bigger variety of everything because of course this is the capital city and there's much more there. We stopped by an ice cream bar. Well, it was a cafeteria called Stash, the Italian way. Almost looked like a futuristic food car. And uh, after walking around in circles around the uh, center mall, we, um, went out into the rain and uh, had a look at a few houses and uh, some other stuff. It was a fun day, yet a miserable day. <laughs>